Hey, what's up guys? Ian from iHelpCorner.com and in this video I'm going to teach you how to fix uh, the no service or searching dot 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 error on the iPhone 3GS. You probably remember being unlocked and then you restored your device into iTunes and then it didn't give you any errors or anything but when your device started back up it just says searching dot 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 or no service and you can't activate it. Even if there's no SIM card in it, it says searching dot dot dot. It is fixable. Uh, what you need to do is download two files. One is RedSnow 0.9.10, whatever beta or RC version. As long as it's 0.9.10, you know, beta something. Use the links in the video description to find the files. So that way you download the right files. And also you're going to need the firmware file for your device. So whichever version you restore to, you need that file as well. Alright, so open up RedSnow and go to the tab where it says extras right here click on that and then you're gonna click on select IPSW which is right here browse for the firmware file you downloaded to your desktop for me it's the one that says iPhone 2 comma 1 5.0.1 2 comma 1 just means 3GS it'll tell you it's been successfully identified you're just gonna hit OK it's gonna ask you if you have a new model of the 3GS if you have a 3GS 8GB, hit yes. If you have a 16 or 32GB, you're going to need to check with your serial number. So find out and then hit whatever you need to hit. So uh, mine's is a newer 3GS, so I'm going to hit yes. Okay, so next you're just going to need to hit back. You're going to hit jailbreak. Wait for this stuff to load, the patching, the kernel and everything. And you're going to see these options, install Cydia, install custom bundle, iPad basement, and deactivate. What you want to do is hit install iPad basement, and then hit yes. See, uh, your 3GS, you're just going to hit yes. You're going to hit deactivate, and install Cydia. Leave custom bundle alone, we don't want to mess with that. I was going to say, please make sure your device is both off and plugged in. So we're going to enter DFU mode quickly. Uh, I'm going to show you a quick trick. What you're going to do is, your device powered on, hold the power button, then hold the home button, then like right away. Keep holding the, the home and power until the iPhone powers off. You're going to keep holding it for until 5 seconds afterwards. So 4, 5. Release the power button, continue holding the home button. You might see like a little discoloration, don't worry, it'll go away. And Red Snow will move by its own, on its own, and you can just set this aside. Don't worry, the discoloration will go away, I promise. Alright, so it's uploading the first stage. Here, I'll put my iPhone right here so you can see what's going on. It's going to be kind of hard to do. Leave red snow on your iPhone alone, just don't mess with it. Alright, so it's going to be uploading the RAM disk and everything, and I'm going to come back to this video once it finishes, because this is going to take a while, so don't be surprised. If you get error 60,000 MS during this right here, uh, click right over here to find out how to fix that. Alright, we're back and the iPhone powered itself off and it's turning back on. So you probably noticed it took about a good 6-7 minutes. And uh, right now when it powers up you should either see uh, no SIM, if there's no SIM card in it, or it'll still say searching. So take out your SIM card if you have it in there right now. So as you can tell, no SIM card in there. Beep. 
All right, it's coming back on right now, and so you can tell it says no sim right now. So that is a good thing. Pretty much, uh, you're done. All you need to do is get an AT&T SIM card. It doesn't even have to be activated. You could get any un inactive AT&T SIM card and just put it in your iPhone and then start the activation process. Uh, what you could do is enter your Wi-Fi password and stuff. Have that all set up. And it's going to join. Hit next. And uh, enter your SIM card and it'll work. If there, if it says please insert a valid SIM or something like that. Uh, right now there's no way to bypass iOS 5 hack, you know, activated or anything like that. You like absolutely need an AT&T SIM card. You could just uh, head over to your local AT&T st uh, store, get a SIM card. I think they're like ten dollars or less, and that'll activate your iPhone right then and there. Uh, you should see Cydia already on your home screen and then what you're going to do is just follow the video right here uh, to fix your no service so you can unlock it again. But you're pretty much done. Your phone is fixed. Thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe. If you have any suggestions for future videos, just let me know. Thanks.